fellow OHS students, welcome to Tapper TV. I'm Colton Peterson. And I'm Shadow Eden. It's hard to believe, but we only have one week left of first quarter. We're starting this week with news about student service projects. Here's Bryce Wagner with some info about students working with Rotary International. Hello, this is Bryce Wagner with a Tapper TV update on the Rotary International. Well, a Rotary Club, we do a lot of like service projects and we are working on iFeed right now. Um, well, iFeed is basically just a large food drive combining um, seven schools in the lacrosse area. Um, and basically it's just all of us coming together and trying to um, collect foods so that we can um, put it back into our community. Um, and in addition to that, we also have the meal packing event in which we are trying to pack about um, 60,000 meals that we will be sending to Nicaragua. How long has the club existed and who started it? Um, I started it last year in, um, I think it was March. So it's only, we, this is, we haven't even been around a year yet. This has been Grace Wagner reporting on Real Dream International from the resource room. Let's send it back to the studio. Thanks, Bryce, for that report. Another student service project involves Megan Cota's annual teddy bear drive. Here's Dade Man. This is Dade Man reporting to you on the teddy bear drive. What is OMS? Okay, OMS is a rare neurological disease of unknown causes, which appears to be the result of an autoimmune process involving the nervous system. What do you do for the teddy bear drive? You just bring a teddy bear to any of the drop-off locations and um, just donate it. <laughs> what inspired you to do so? Um, my best friend Chloe, she has been doing the teddy bear drive for um, six years and I just wanted to help her out. Where can you donate? Um, we have five other drop-off locations. They're Houseburg Diamonds at Valley, Valley View Mall, the middle school and the high school. And then we have Optical fashions and my life chiropractic. This is Dane Man signing out. What a great cause. Good luck, Megan. If you watch carefully in this next story about the student job board, you might see a very handsome festival cashier. Here's Pachia Vu. Oh, hey, it's you, guys there. Welcome to Topper TV. My name is Pachia Vu, and today we'll be visiting popular jobs at OHS. I'm Mrs. Kudel, and I work in student services. How often is the job board updated? The jobs board is updated whenever I receive information from employers looking for um, workers. I recommend jobs that pay you money so you can go shopping, get gas, or eat out at lunch. And don't forget, if you're under 18, you need a work permit. Thanks for watching Tiber TV. See you next time. If you don't have to work too much this weekend, you might want to check out some of the playoff and state tournament action that will be going on. Good luck to all our student athletes who are competing this weekend. Another thing you can do this weekend is get your Halloween costumes ready. Here's Matthew Johnson Lester with an update on Monday night's festivities. This is Matthew Johnson Lester from Topper TV reporting to you about Halloween and what people are going to dress up as. Okay, so this year for Halloween, um, our church, the Onalaska United Methodist Church, is going to be trick-or-treating so others can eat. So on Halloween, we're going to go out all dressed in our costumes, not sure what they'll be yet, um, and go door-to-door -door and ask for donations of food. And all the food will be going to iFeed, the Rotary food drive that takes place at Logan High School. So Isaac, what are you going to do for this Halloween? Um, you know, stay home, hand some uh, candy out to the trick-or-treaters. And dress up as for Halloween this year. I'm going to be Chuck Bass with a beard. This is Matthew Johnson Lester from Copy TV signing out, and we're kicking it back to you at the studio. Thanks for watching another great episode of Tapper TV. See you in November. Carefully in the next part, you might. Who's struggling now? Mine's a lot more memorized. You got like three sentences.